what's up guys today we have a new video and we have few things to talk about will paul and rington still be on social media on magic's anger is up to something he wants to sign down platinum to magic's empire and it is crazy we do have tanisha donham now she wants to sue this dude mujaku for claiming he is the father of her son and we all know that that's a lie now let's talk about it race here device tanisha Donor to sue Tanzania radio presenter Mujaku. I'm sure you guys remember AC, right? She's a legend, oh. she's a legend. That's according to me, okay? Now it looks like she's irritated by Mujaku for bully on social media, and it is time to stop his clout chasing behavior. She says that what the presenter has been doing is very wrong and disrespectful. Mujaku started making these allegations, the reason being that he resembles Tanasha's son, Nasib Jr. Now this is what Racy said. This is so wrong in so many levels. Kama baba mwenye familia yake sidhani kama hii kitu inachekesha. This is unacceptable, okay? Kuna watu wanaadhirika kisaikolojia kabisa sababu ya sub bullying. Mujaku haufanyi sawa hata kidogo. Na inchi za wenzetu ugekusha kwa ndani for this. Tanasha dona get a lawyer and sue this this is beyond disrespectful. Tanisha Donna ended up responding to that and this is what she had to say. Empty vessels make the loudest noises. You know empty, he'll be receiving a letter from my lawyer soon. Let's see if he'll still be as enthusiastic by the time he is in the court, okay? So she says that Mujak will be receiving a letter from her lawyers very soon and the empty vessels make the loudest noise. Now moving on we do have Magic's anger, the beat king. Now he says that he wants Diamond Platinum to join Magic's empire and also the old Wasafi team, you know, Kinalava Lava. Uh, Rivani, Bosso. Now this situation is kind of confusing. Magix is out here sharing a lot of posts on his IG page, calling out Diamond Platinum and his producer Stukizi. Now let me break it down for you guys. It all started after Diamond released a new video of the quarantine, but Magic's fail. What kind of song is that? You the Diamond Platinums, you can do better than that, okay? This is what Magic said. Someone tell Diamond Platinums I want to send him and his old team Magic's Empire Studios. This is after watching his new video. I don't hate Diamond. Na siyo competition, nani ya kona pesa. Kuna kitu about that new song, the only way to save that is to work together. So literally, Magix has been sharing series of posts on his IG page. He went ahead and said, Wasafi cannot even spell the word quarantine, unasema quarantine. What does that even supposed to mean? Na unasema it's 5 million event hapa Kenya, then unatharao Kenyan artist. I'm talking on behalf of everyone, even if I get killed. Kwanza leo kama how to join Magix Empire, you'll be paid 50,000 for performance. 5 million wasani watalipo ni Calligraph Jones, Otile Brown, Sauti Sol, and the rest. Now he also explained his situation with the Diamonds producer Stukizi. So he said that he been friends with Stukiz for a long time. He even leaves the comments under his post. But Sasa Diamond Amemtishia, he isn't going to do that no more. No more friendship. That is over because of Diamond Platinums. This is what he had to say. I didn't know people can worship a man. Me and Stukizi tumekua marafiki even before. Sasa jamaka tukosanisha jana usiku. I don't blame you though. He forced the producer to delete my comments. Alright dog, it is okay to say you don't want to sign. Now lastly we do have Willy Pose and Rington. Now these guys have been going back and forth on social media calling out each other. At this point I don't want to say if this is a beef or a competition okay. Now you guys know that Rington released a new song Mawe Kupigwa Mawe or Zoya Kupigwa Mawe or whatever the case. And he used Azir as vixen. Maybe he featured Han because he had to say 
Rington featuring Azia na Senya. Now immediately after Rington released his song, Will Paul dropped his too. TikTok. Now let's get this right, guys. Rington used Azia, and we all know Azia is the TikTok queen. Pose did a song and he called it TikTok. Now there is somewhere in the song when he mentions Kitambi Itawazan. So basically, Will Paul did this song because Rington had Azia on his song. So it's kind of competition going on between these two. Rington talked about that and this is what he had to sing. Tunajua umetoa song ya kukuzika na itukifuka uta trend vile mganga alikuambia na tunakuheshimu please wache kupiga wimbo wangu na Aziad mawe so Pose ended up responding and he said this wananiita kimpoze baba lao tiktok out now lakini Rington wewe ni punda tu sasa hiyo ni song gani umetoa at Zoya Kupigwa Ma, what you wanted to say in Zoya Kupigwa Chuma, we know you, we know about your bedroom cases as well. You act holy, na unaweka madem kutwa kwa gospel song. We won't stop judging people, you are worse. Now ingia YouTube and watch my new song titled TikTok. And of course, it's better than yours. Now later, there was kind of battle happening at Texas and Dela stories. You know, it was kind of voting. Will Paul said here that kindly go to Texas and Dela stories and vote for my song TikTok. Make it number one against Rington's new song. Who your mama tumfunze adabu leo again. So Pose had the lead with 66 percent and rington at 44 percent and that's it guys for this video what do you think about these stories leave a comment below hit the like button subscribe to the channel if you're new and turn on notifications so that you don't miss anything